Hey guys, what's up? It's Bax here and I'm in my bathroom and tonight we're going to be testing out the Dyson Airwrap. So my coworker, wonderful friend of mine, she uh, gave me this to try out and we're going to try it out. We're going to see how it works. I've never used one before. I've always wanted one, but so they've been a little out of price range. So tonight we're gonna do some nighttime skincare and then we're going to try and see what this air wrap is all about. So let's get into it. All right, so tonight's first step is going to be with a little bit of toner. This one is by Pixie, and it is the Clarity Tonic. So I'm gonna put a little bit in my hands. Now again, how I do it and how you do it could be two separate things. Doesn't mean it's a bad thing. Just whatever works for your skin, as long as you're not using St. Ives Scrub. It's good, right? Yeah. And then I need to Make sure I brush out my lash extensions. I need to make sure I need to brush out my lash extensions. And I know the lighting is not the best in here. However, I just got out of the shower. Just, you know, it's one of those nights where I just wanted to test out something new. My skin has not been the best lately, so I'm gonna go in with the Ordinary. I'm gonna use both the Niacinamide and this is the Argoline Solution. So we're gonna use these both together, but we're gonna use this first because it is a more of a water-based than like a serum. So I just push it into the skin. So let's look at this beautiful bad boy. So it comes in a really beautiful, it's velvet inside. This thing's huge. Woo! So I'm gonna plug this bad boy in. Oh, that's nice, it has one of these on it. So if you ever use it on a plug that doesn't have that, good to know, right? Good to have. All right, so now that that has set for a second, we're gonna put some of the niacinamide on there. Again, just pushing it into my skin. And let's see. So it comes with this fancy little brush here, which we can give that a try first. And then it comes with, it looks like a bigger brush. Mm, a little dry, yeah, hair dry. Nugget, <laughs> it's not scary. Then it comes with these bad boys. And it comes with a bunch of different sizes of barrels. So there's that one. Stop. It's not scary, Nugget. It actually comes with three different sizes of barrels. So there's... Let me show you all the sizes. So there's these sizes here. I'm not exactly sure. But probably the smaller one because I have short, fine hair. So let me get the other smaller one. Yep. Because as you can see, they're both going different directions. So, all right. Now it is time for my night cream. I'm gonna be using the LMS Pro Collagen Night Cream. Then it's nice and thick. I'm gonna move it around a little bit before really letting it settle in. I do love Elemis products. The only thing that I'm not a huge fan of is the price point and just, it has a lot of fragrance in it, so. So I'm not a huge fan of the fragrance. It's very perfumey. It smells good, but just not something that I want in a skincare. And of course, last but not least, I'm gonna use the Super Bloom Eye Cream. I'm gonna use the Living Proof Restore Perfecting Spray first. Just 
just want to have some heat protectant, even though it doesn't use too much, I don't believe. Okay, so I think how we do this. Then to take off like that. All right, next I'm gonna use a Frizzies Dream Curls by John Frieda. Just give it a good shake. Because we definitely want some dream curls. Yeah. I think that's the dream. <laughs> Just kind of work it on through. Now my hair is a little damp still, but my hair dries <laughs> my hair dries pretty quick just because it's very fine. So. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> wow, okay. I see you. Okay. Okay, that was a good first impression. Holy cow. I like to have curls going different ways without having to flip this around, but and out. Not too bad if we're going like that, but I definitely can see where it's better to use like if you want to switch it out. So it does get a little warm, so this little little thingy with Bob here. So then that one, okay. Ooh. Gonna suck a bunch of hair up in there, huh? <laughs> Guys. Wow. Holy cow. Oh my goodness. Holy moly. Okay, that was, I think I got too much hair, but it still turned out pretty good. All right, I'm gonna finish, and I'm gonna come back here and give you guys, um, let me finish this bottom half first so you guys don't have to watch me do it, so I will be right back. And so for me, I found that holding the hair and like kind of letting it letting the curling iron, well, the air wrap, letting the air wrap pull the hair in has really helped. So switch that out, switch that in. Let's get some hair. So I want curls, now I switched it back because I want curls facing, like going away from my face. So that is why I did that. Turn that up a little bit. That. Holy cow. This has like a lot of volume. Wow, I'm really impressed y'all. Holy cow. Switch it out one last time. Holy moly. All right, let's shake it out. Wow. These are beautiful curls. Now I think there is a little bit of a learning curve because um, obviously my bottoms are not as nice as the top but holy cow, the volume that these curls have, like, this is like unbelievable. But this came from like an air, like an air wrap dryer kind of thing. Oh my gosh, like, let me fix this one though. Oh yeah, that's good. And the fact that like, there's not really frizz and my hair is pretty damaged right now from lightening it, so. I'm impressed. What do you guys think? Would you try this? Would you use it? I'm, I'm happy with it. Finger, finger comb my curls a little bit. Move them separated. The only thing I will say is, is it a little hard to switch around where with a curling iron you could kind of 
Um, but I think, don't quote me though, I think on the newer models that you can actually, like there's a switch where it kind of like moves the blade, I think, but again, don't quote me, but I can't get over just like, and again, learning curve, like obviously could have probably done longer on this, but I like, for never using this before and only watching uh, other YouTubers and, and just people in the Dyson hair group, this is really, like, I'm impressed with myself. So, what do you guys think? Leave a comment below. Be sure to subscribe to my channel before you leave today and hit that bell icon so you get notified each and every time I drop a video. Thanks for trying the hair wrap with me. See you next time, guys. Way too much, Gus. Gotta cut me off, cut me off of the products. So I'm gonna go in with the, no, Gus, stop eating everything in damn sight. The only thing that I'm not a huge fan of, stop. So let's get some product in our hair first.